All right, it's time for another Dr. Squatch review today. Birchwood Breeze, you're on deck. All right, so Birchwood Breeze, where does it rank among the other Dr. Squatch soaps? I have a video, I'll leave a link in the outro, where I ranked all 19 of the other Dr. Squatch scents. And since I made that video, they added like three or four new scents to the catalog. So this is why Birchwood Breeze is now being made in a different video because it was not available at the time. So I will let you know today where I rank this one among the other ones. I'm also looking to get the Fresh Falls and the, uh, what's the other one called? The Moon Rock, I think it's called. So I'll be letting you know where those new scents rank in the Dr. Squatch catalog. This one's kind of weird for me because I really wanted to like this soap. I thought I was going to. Mm, I, very odd scent. This is, I, I can't even describe this scent. It reminds me, it kind of reminds me of like cornmeal or something. It's 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 very odd. Or it, it reminds me of like when I was a little kid and I took these like baby chewable aspirin. I don't know if any of you tried those when you're a kid, if you know what taste or scent I'm referring to, but this reminds me of that for some reason. I don't know. I I don't like this scent much. The the soap itself, it's a good quality soap. Like you can really feel the ingredients in there. It's thick. Like when you rub your hands against it, the ingredients are sticking out of it. So it's thick, it's rough. It feels good. I mean, all of these soaps are good soaps, just to say, but we really, where it makes a difference is how it smells and how it feels. And it, feel, it feels fine, but the scent, I, I don't like this scent. It's very odd. It's different, it's unique. I'm not saying it's bad. Because, hey, they took a shot with this one, just like they do with all of them. They try to make them smell different, unique, so I respect that. This one, to me, I just don't like this scent at all. It just, it's very, it's very odd. It's, it's pretty strong. Uh, not too strong. It's not overly strong. Like, when I, after I use it in the bathroom, I can smell it for a little while, but it's not too bad. Um, I don't like the smell though. I don't like the way my bathroom smells after I use it. I don't like uh, how my skin will smell after I use it, even though it's not very strong on the skin and it doesn't linger long and it fades away pretty fast. But I just do not like this scent. Uh, I even come into my bathroom, I'll be honest, and almost felt nauseous after it because I just don't like this scent. It's not bad scent. It's, it's not... <laughs> it's not like um it's not like sardines or anchovies or anything like that that's gonna make you gag. I just don't like the scent. Um, and I'm gonna go ahead and put this up because I don't even want to smell it anymore. I'll go ahead and read the ingredients so that you have an idea of what's in here to decide if it's something that you think you might like or not. Uh Saponified oils of olive, sustainable palm and coconut, shea butter, natural fragrance, birch bark powder, pumice powder, niuli essential oil, titanium dioxide, kaolin clay, and sea salt. So that's the ingredients there. I like the new packaging they have. They revised the packaging. I think this looks good. As you can see, it's a little... Uh, <laughs> A little different than the way it used to be so it's easier to open without having that ribbon around the box so I really like this new packaging uh, I just don't like this the scent of this at all so I made a video where I ranked all 19 Dr. Squat scents in their catalog I'll leave a link on the outro if you want to check that out and since I made that video <laughs> They've added like three or four new scents. So I'm having to get those as they come out one by one. And as I get them, I'll review them and I'll let you know where each one ranks in the entire Dr. Squatch catalog. Okay, so I had a total of 19 on that video. And then I got Wood Barrel Bourbon to make that 20. So I ranked 20 of them. 
and I revised my rankings and I moved Wood Barrel Bourbon all the way up to number two. Speaking of Wood Barrel Bourbon, here's my bar right here. I keep this on a soap dish in my room because I love the smell of it. It replaced my spearmint basil. This is better than an air freshener because air fresheners have chemicals. So I use these soaps as air fresheners. They're not very strong, but it's better than nothing. You can smell it when you're close to it. And this wood barrel bourbon smells amazing. Mm. Got to smell this to get over that scent of the birchwood breeze. All right, so I had ranked Nautical Sage at 19, so that would have been bumped down to 20. So I would have ranked 20 soaps altogether, 20 cents altogether, and Nautical Sage was at the bottom. It was number 19. When I added Wood Barrel Bourbon, Nautical Sage would go down to number 20. Okay, now we have a new contender for the worst. I have to rank Birchwood Breeze at the bottom and put Nautical Sage ahead of Birchwood Breeze. So as of now, I've got 21 cents ranked and Birchwood Breeze is number 21. I do not like this scent. I'm sorry, Dr. Squatch. I love the new packaging though, but I just don't like this scent at all. Sorry, but... I still recommend Dr. Squatch for the most part. You know they're going to have hits and misses. That just goes to the territory. It's part of it. I would have a giveaway and give this away if I hadn't already used it. <laughs> I don't think anyone wants any used soap. But I would definitely give this away if I had any takers because I don't want it. I don't want this scent lingering in my bathroom anymore. And I may even possibly consider tossing it out because I just don't want it. But like I said, that's not to discourage you from trying other Dr. Squatch scents because they have some good ones. I recommend Wood Barrel Bourbon or Gold Moss, Spearmint Basil, Pine Tar, Bay Rum. Those are all really good. Cool Fresh Aloe is really good. Mm. Wood Barrel Bourbon. Mm. I love this scent. It's so good. So if a burglar broke into my house, I would just take out this block of birchwood breeze and toss at him. And it'd probably hit him in the head and he'd smell it and be like, ugh, and then he'd, he'd run out. Ugh. So I mentioned on a video that I was having a hard time finding Fresh Falls because it was out of stock on Dr. Squatch's site. And now it's just totally gone. Before there was a sign that said Fresh Falls out of stock. Now it's not even listed and saying out of stock. It's just totally gone. But I found a bar on eBay from a seller. So I was able to order that and that's on the way. I should have that soon. So hopefully I'll be able to do a Fresh Falls review for you soon. And then I also got Moon Rock from the Dr. Squatch site. That's there for a limited time. So if you want to check that one out, I have no idea what to expect or how it smells. But I should be getting that one soon and have a review for that one up too. So that's about it for this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing. Thanks for watching and God bless.